is game five, it's worth five points. Amir, you need to get back in the ball game. This is how it works. It's very, very simple. It's called hang bar, and all you've got to do is hang oh. on a bar. Amir, I would imagine that this is right up your street. Upper body strength. Yeah. And what do you need for boxing, Dan? <laughs> Upper body strength. Upper body strength. Correct. You can see two parallel bars that are directly opposite each other. We want you to jump onto the bars. You can't cross your legs and you can't hold the bar like this. It's got to be like this, opposite each other, eye to eye, man to man. The winner will be the person who can hang on the bar the longest. So therefore the loser will be the first person to fall off. Dan, how often do you go to the gym? Four times a week, maybe five, sometimes. Do you do chin-ups, pull-ups? No. <laughs> <laughs> Amir, upper body strength? Yeah, it should be good. Um, in boxing, you know, it's all upper body. So, yeah, I should have no problem with that, hopefully. All right, good luck. Gentlemen, if you'd like to take your positions, there are five points up for grabs here. <laughs> Amir, if you win this, you'll go in the lead. Dan, if you want to put some chalk on as well, get a bit of better grip. This is worth five points. It will increase your lead and it will put you in the lead, Amir, if you can win this. Good luck, gentlemen. £50,000 on the line. Three, two, one, go. The hang bar, physical and mental test for both men. The hands locked on, heads down as they go into their own particular zone. Amir Khan on the right there, the lighter of the two men, the Commonwealth lightweight champion. And Dan, nine years his senior, and at 14 stone, considerably heavier. Well, this is a test of concentration as much as it is a test of strength, so you'd think that Amir would have this all in his favour. And Dan just flickers his eyes up, and Amir quite confident. Beautifully balanced, as you would expect. And remember, it's Amir who's playing catch-up at the moment. Having one nail it and grind trial. Now finds himself behind, having lost the pole and the squeeze to the man in blue. Coming up to the minute now. Very good from both men, but just look how relaxed Amir is. Confident. Dan just sense maybe a little tension coming into his body feet just moving but the hands oh was that a little slip there from Dan looks up there Amir will have caught that sign telltale sign and there's another one and Amir Khan he will notice that his man is weakening and remember five points at stake a minute and a half it's brilliant by both men and you sense that the grip is slipping a little bit from the man on the left in blue. The arms will be burning. And this isn't just actually the arms, it's the chest muscles that come in to play here. Coming up to two minutes, the face is saying everything. The fingers are beginning to slip. But Dan, look at the grip. He needs to get that thumb back on. Amir eyeballing him. Two minutes. Oh, he drops right on two minutes. And Amir pumps himself to victory. <laughs> that was absolutely awesome. Two minutes. Give them both a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> wow. The fingers just slipped okay. away. Just slipped away. Do you think that was because you didn't put enough chalk on, or was that just because no, your arms gave in? My weight was just pulling me down, and then I, I, my fingers just gave way. Amir rubbed a little bit of salt into his wound there by doing some pull-ups. How are you feeling after that? Could you go on for another two minutes? Oh, easy, yeah, you know. I could, I could, <laughs> uh, I could see it in his eyes, um, and he, he was in pain, and, and I just kept hold of it, and... Yeah, I could have done easy another five minutes, not mine, two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I did love was the fact that you just, you just hung there with a little cheeky grin on your face, thinking, come on, Dan, bring it on. Congratulations, Thanks, Amir. Mate. Let's take a look at the scoreboard. So, 
Amir's just won five points, taking him into the lead by one point. It's not over yet, Dan. There are two games to play. Game six and game seven. Dan's got two more chances to beat the star. Will he walk away £50,000 richer? Or will Amir emerge triumphant, sending Dan home with absolutely... It's a miracle!